So I recently picked up the Oklahoma Air Jordan 4 PEs, added these to my collection a few weeks ago when I was out in LA. I was at the Streamy Awards and I stopped by Untied and they had these in my size. I was like, you know what? I gotta get them. I just got the Michigan 4s from them a few weeks before that and it was only right. Now low key, I feel like I might have to complete the set. But either way, we're gonna talk about this shoe. We're gonna talk about some of the other PEs that Oklahoma does have and the ones that I might wanna go after for my collection. I'll give you guys some on foot looks and everything like that, poles, fire and trash. And most importantly, we gotta show these to my dad and see what he thinks. So if you haven't already, consider subscribing and joining the fam. I love posting videos like this and especially giving you guys looks at early sneakers or PE and exclusive sneakers like this that other people may just not be able to get their hands on. So for this shoe in particular, we have the Air Jordan 4 model. Now these ones came from the College Series pack from the Suede pack. So there were six different shoes that came in that pack and this is one of the schools. We saw Georgetown, Marquette, Florida Gators, Michigan, Oklahoma right here and UNC. I currently have the Michigan 4 PE from the set as well. If you wanna see the full video breaking down the entire set, I'll make sure I'll link that for you guys down below in the description. But for now, we need to talk about these a little bit more. So looking at the bottom of the shoe, you have an icy blue translucent Air Jordan 4 outsole. This is one thing that I have been worried about when it comes to this PE set in particular, simply because you got two different things. The outsoles could start to yellow, the arms on the sides could start to yellow, and then the foam on the midsoles could actually start to deteriorate deteriorate over time, which is not going to be anytime soon, but you know, many years from now could be a possible thing. So typically when it comes to getting PEs, especially when it comes to Air Jordan 1s, it makes it a lot more simple for the longevity of wearing the sneaker and have it in your collection to be able to actually rock it in your rotation as well. When you're adding more rare gems like this to your collection, you want to always make sure that you're paying attention to those things as well, because yes, it's a more expensive shoe. You have more invested into it, whether it may be through trades or through actual cast that you use to purchase the shoe either way the shoe has a value to it it's a lot more rare limited exclusive and that means you want to have that shoe last for a long time so that's stuff that you got to think about for current time and in the future which again we talk about all that type of stuff in the sneakerhead academy as well so if you ever are interested in that i'll have the link for you guys down below now going on to the other parts of this shoe you got a two-tone midsole white on the bottom and then a red and then a white speckle on the red and then you have the red with the white speckle on the front end of the shoe and then this wraps all the way around through the inside of the foot as well and then throughout the upper you got that deep red suede all throughout here and it's just a very very nice shoe they did the same materials throughout the six in the pack so you're gonna get that same type of quality and presentation throughout each and every model whether you get the georgetowns the unc's or these or whatever all the materials on these shoes are gonna be very very correct at the end of the day so for those that don't know the ou oklahoma air jordan pe this was specifically made for the football team so as you can see on the back of the tongue you have the football patch right here stitched in right there and then you have a red sock liner the back tab matches the midsole red with the white speckle and then the white jump man right here in the center of that i think it would be a very very dope touch if they did have the school logo on the back end but i know they did the logos on all the tongues of the shoes with the jump mans on the backs of all the shoes so they stayed consistent when they went throughout the entire set now these come with a standard pair of premium red laces and an additional pair of white laces as well you got an all red insole with a white jump man on the right foot and then the Oklahoma University OU on the left foot right here. Also, I forgot to mention on the tag behind the foot on the left foot, it says Oklahoma. And then on the right foot, it says football. Everything is pretty much straightforward when it comes to the sneaker and the color blocking and the materials and everything like that. So I'm definitely just excited to have these in the collection. And I'm glad that I found a pair that had been worn once because now, oh yeah, I already rocked them. Again. I Just know, <laughs> I'm about to be rocking these. And I know everybody says, wear your shoes, wear your shoes. But trust me i'm just telling you when you get that feeling of a sneaker that had already been worn once and is really lightly used and it's super clean you can get it at a better deal and you're able to save a couple bucks and you know you're gonna wear the shoe anyway it just makes you want to rock the shoe even more so i'm excited about that for those reasons and again that's just stuff that we talk about in the academy and how to be strategic and save money in different ways but still get the shoes that you want and try to make those smart plays to still build and grow your collection at the same time so now i'm gonna cut to an on foot look real quick and show you guys what the sneakers look like on foot we'll come back here and then i'll show you guys what my dad thinks because uh, i'm interested to see what he says <laughs> What did 
you guys think about these on foot. I know I didn't put the whole like outfit with the pants and the right socks and all the stuff together. I was just trying to show you guys what the shoe looks like on foot real quick. So maybe next time I'll show you guys how to style the sneaker and everything like that. But I just wanted to give you guys a quick look at the shoe on foot as well. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. Now, I think it's time. I think it's time we go show my dad the shoe and see what he thinks. You know, he loves my PEs. He loves all that different stuff. And I want to see what he rates these out of 10 because yes, this is definitely a very clean shoe, but I think I'm going to give these like out of all Air Jordan 4s to ever release and all the PE options out there in this world, I would say I'm going to give this shoe like a solid a solid solid eight like i'm gonna say this is an eight out of a ten sneaker right here i definitely really like these maybe an eight and a half mm, i don't know maybe we'll say eight and a half we'll see how uh, i gotta think about that i gotta i gotta reevaluate after i see it. no 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 i'm sticking with eight and a half we're rocking with eight and a half let's go see what my dad thinks all right so i just got these right here what do you think about these oklahoma sooners college jordan 4 pe right here these are super sick. I just added them to my collection. <laughs> what do you rate these out of 10? 11. 11? <laughs> these really? are super sick. Out of Jordan 4s, what would you say these would rank like out of ones that you've seen or ones that are in my collection or your well, collection? Well, these are better than the gray ones. <laughs> <laughs> he likes the cool gray 4s. <laughs> but, but no, these are super sick. But you know when they come to these colors, like these reds and maroons, whatever yeah. color you want to call this, this is dope. What, uh, what do you think the value is of this shoe? This shoe probably 800? 800? Keep going up. Huh? Oh yeah, you say there's a PE, like a exclusive, what, 3,000? A little bit more. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, definitely not getting these. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got no chance to get these ones. <laughs> Just for me. <laughs> no, you can't hang that up. <laughs> I wanted to see what you thought about them, when it comes to the price, the colors and everything. Do you think it's worth that price tag? I think so. I, I mean, Cause it's so limited it's gonna be a limited shoe everybody right. can't get it right so i mean so that right there is gonna kill it just like the duck shoes and all the other ones yep, you, know, yep, yep. you know so yeah the price tag can be up there so if anybody has a size 14 what are you gonna tell them <laughs> don't send them my way it costs too much <laughs> <Don't go for laughs> that one. i would love to have the shoe but thirty five hundred dollars nope <laughs> yeah this is definitely a very Pretty penny on this shoe, but had to add these to my collection. Woo! Got them for a good deal. I couldn't pass it up. They're my size. I didn't already low key rocked them a little bit. This Looking is a good looking to rocking shoe. these this year. Yeah. But see, this can't go in the regular shoes because it's not for regular people. Right. So it can't go in the top shoes of the year and all that. Right. So what do you think? Like, oh man, you saw some of my shoes I got this year for my PEs. Yeah. I picked up over 20 pairs of PEs this year alone. And I can't remember all of them because I'm sure I ain't going to do that. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be a crazy year. Maybe, do you want to be in that video? Oh, definitely. All right. So everybody in the comment section, drop a comment down below if you guys want to see him in the my top 10 PE pickups of the year video. Top 15. <laughs> we going to have to do 15? <laughs> yeah, for sure. You, so? you got 20 some pair. I know. There's so a lot of good options just, out there. Yeah. Okay. Well, you rated these 11 out of 10. I gave them a solid 8.5. That, that you so hard on shoes. <laughs> Golly. I thought it was a solid 8.5. How do they please you? Well, it's not ducks, <laughs> first off. It is a clean shoe. But the color. The color is fire. The materials. Definitely a nice shoe. But all PEs are nice. Yeah. You did good right here. It's a good shoe. This is a good Definitely shoe. Definitely a good shoe. All right, tell the people we're out. Tell them to subscribe, like, all the We're out, subscribe, things. like. Log on to my channel. I mean, his channel. <laughs> all, all the good stuff. <laughs> all right, we out. Yo, before you go, I just launched my Sneakerhead Academy where we got everything on the inside. I teach you all the stuff that I learned over the past 15 years when it comes to sneakers, scaling, real estate, you name it. We talk about all of it in there. And there's an eight week program plus a bunch of monthly giveaways. I give away shoes literally way too much, honestly. But either way, I'll see you guys on the inside. Hit the link down below in my description or pinned in the comment section for DJ Sneakerhead Academy. And I'll see you guys over there.